Nest.js is a Node.js framework for building scalable server-side applications with TypeScript. It provides a suite of tools that leverage either Fastify or Express to facilitate rapid development and predictable, readable code. It supports REST and GraphQL APIs out of the box, or you might use it to build a full-stack application using the model view controller pattern, similar to frameworks like Laravel or Ruby on Rails, and it contains a ton of built-in modules to work with databases, handle security, implement streaming, and any Anything else you can imagine doing in a server-side application. Nest has its own very powerful command line tool, and you can scaffold out a new project with the nest new command. That provides a code base pre-configured with Jest for testing, and set up with TypeScript to help us write more readable and reliable code. In the source directory, you'll notice a controller, which is a fundamental building block of the framework. It's responsible for handling incoming HTTP requests and returning responses back to the client. To implement a controller, simply add the controller decorator to a class, then inside the class, you can implement methods and decorate them with HTTP verbs like get, post, patch, put, etc. By default, this will create an HTTP endpoint on the root URL, but you can pass a string to the decorator to change the route or implement dynamic route parameters. In addition, Nest provides other decorators to control things like the status code and headers. Then in the method itself, parameter decorators can be used to access the request parameters or body. And finally, the return value from the method is the response body that gets sent back down to the client. What's awesome about Nest is that you can use the CLI to automatically generate more controllers to keep your code organized as it grows in complexity. But there's more to Nest than just controllers. A provider is a class that contains shared logic throughout the entire application and can be injected as a dependency where needed. Any class with the injectable decorator can be injected in the constructor of another class. For example, a provider can be implemented as a guard to handle role-based user authentication, or it might be implemented as a pipe to efficiently validate and transform values in a controller. And lastly, we have the module decorator, which allows code to be organized into smaller chunks where it can be lazy loaded to run faster in serverless environments. This has been Nest.js in 100 seconds. If you want to see more short videos like this, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.